can be considered as a mirror which reflects the condition and the status of the transformer. By taking sample from this oil, we can thermal expansion means the tendency of the material to change the length. One beautiful physical application for this thermal expansion is using the bimetal strip. The length of each strip will change differently. One of them will be longer than practice used in manufacturing the bimetal thermometer. They are used in circuit breakers for the overload protection. The helical or spiral shape is formed inside this tube and this will be in blue and yellow points are on top for minimum and maximum temperature and this is the window it's made of polycarbonate it's uv stabilized the pointer will move based on the rise of temperature bismillah rahman rahim the oil inside the tank of oil filled distribution transformer can be considered as a mirror which reflects the condition and the status of the transformer. We saw before by taking sample from this oil, we can see if there are some foreign materials, some water content, some gases, some particles, small particles from the insulation materials, from the paper and wood, resulting from corona or partial discharge from the widening with time Sampling is one aid for inspecting the status of the oil field distribution transformer. Also, in the last episode, we saw that when we were talking about the oil level indicator, that this quantity of oil, which can be measured by this oil level indicator, can give us some information about the status of the transformer. Another very important aid in continuous monitoring of the status of the transformer is the temperature, oil temperature. By continuously monitoring this temperature, we can have a feedback about the condition of the distribution transformer. Because during abnormal condition, overload short circuit will generate heat, which will increase the temperature of the oil inside the distribution transformer. So monitoring the temperature of the transformer is crucial and this temperature is monitored using a thermometer and the most popular type is the bimetal one bimetal thermometer like this one the basic principle of operation of bimetal thermometer is dependent on what do we call thermal expansion of material thermal expansion means the tendency of the material to change the length or the volume or the area in response to the change of temperature. This change in length or volume or area is different from material to another. So one beautiful physical application for this thermal expansion is using the bimetal strip. The concept of bimetal strip is that since different materials will respond differently to the change in temperature so we will bring two materials attach them together only attaching not mixing mixing of two materials will result in an alloy we are not talking about alloy only attachment of this material together so before attaching these two different material strip together if we heat them suppose that at the beginning the two links are the same. If we heat them, if we warm them, the length of each strip will change differently. One of them will be longer than the other. Now imagine that we fix these strips together, then heat them. What will result is bending of this bimetal strip. This bending of the metal strip is a mechanical movement. So this change in temperature is converted to a mechanical motion. If we replace this straight strip by helical or spiral or cold one, we increase the length. Increasing the length will increase the sensitivity. And this is the practice used in manufacturing the bimetal thermometers. There are so many physical applications of the bimetal strips. Originally, at the beginning, they were used in clocks. They are used in thermostat, in air conditioning systems. They are used in circuit breakers for the overload protection and so many other applications. This thermometer, which is used in oil-filled distribution transformer, is a bimetal thermometer. 
Normally the two materials, either copper or steel or brass and steel, and the helical or spiral shape is formed inside this tube, and this will be inside the oil of the transformer. If we heat it, this heat will be converted into mechanical movement, which will move this pointer, the white pointer, and we can see here there is a red one. The red pointer will record the maximum temperature and sometimes this can come without contact, sometimes with contacts. If with contacts, as we can see there is blue and yellow points are on top for minimum and maximum temperature. These will be connected to a micro switch. See here there is yellow and blue wires are coming here to use them for tripping the circuit breaker or giving alarm or whatever and this is the window it's made of polycarbonate it's uv stabilized in order not to get yellowish with time also as we saw in the oil level indicator the script and numbers are white on a black background to make the visibility easy and all the materials are corrosion resistance. We can heat this element and we will see how the pointer will move based on the rise of temperature.